is it working okay hi guys welcome back to some more shadows overloading over here at the big waste um yeah we're we're trying to figure things out over here i guess we can go straight to dolphin's house oh black shapes oh god there's looking big and strong but we got our mop back can't stop me anymore Dead. The fuck? easy so uh, yeah Charles went missing over here somewhere and we're trying to find him I can open it. Dolphin padlock key. Tarnished. So I have to find... Hey! Nice! Hmm... Charles Wrench. Doesn't seem like the kind of guy who'd lose his tools carelessly, nor the kind of guy who'd leave his trash around. Weird tracks in the mud. This couple clearly happened. Oh shit. Return it to Charles when you find him. Oh! Hey! Another padlock key. The mossy. Sordid grease. It is a powerful tool. Died of natural causes. All of them. Hmm. This couch faces the wall. Must have been the punishment couch. Haha. <laughs> uh, completely flooded. You'll need some kind of breathing apparatus to go down there. Oh! Well, well, well. Yes. Uh, sever her head. Oh, it's empty. Wow. Wow, there's padlocks everywhere. Steamy swamp worms. Ugh. Many drawers. A match, a fuse, a recovered padlock, a dire corn holder. What? In your muscle. Plus six physical damage and heals you for free. Whoa, that's pretty strong. What about the sink? Fishy! We are fishing in a sink in a swamp. What? Oh, gotta get the mossy key. A key in a block of ice. Hmm. And a fruit cocktail. That's not bad. Oh, we'll need to somehow melt that somewhere worm. Yeah, it is flooded. Right amount of air to float like this. Nature is really glorious. Rusty can of Vichy Swiss. So mysteries and exciting tales of non-violent crimes. A pile of silver bars. They sell for plenty. I would imagine so. Cold armor and sleaze armor. Hmm. What do we have here? Clammy scarf. Hmm. 
Oh, not a lot. Plus five hot armor. We can drop the frozen key. Aha. Uh -huh. And we can fish. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Glob of wet hair. Fucking disgusting. Nasty goo. Why are we doing this? Handful of dirty water. What exactly did you expect to get here? Hey, we got the padlock key. Wet. Rhino Balm, Mercury Eye Drops. We got those before. Can you choose? Okay, no, so it's a specific one for each of them. Oh boy, second floor. These doors are padlocked. Disappointingly empty. Not even a BB gun or a creepy doll. Maybe the doll is hiding somewhere. Aha! Uh -huh. Padlock key. Another wire coat hanger and work pants. Plus four physical armor. That's not bad. What do we have? Plus. Eh, I do like the muscle. Here, here, shiny key. Radium Rouge. Oh, a jewelry box. Snake tooth ring and amethyst earrings. When you apply poison, apply free extra. Generates free HP per round. Yeah, still not as strong as that. Junk mail, fuse, match, and the disappointing key. We still haven't found a letter opener. Oh my god. Hi, Zach Fons. Bye, Zach Fons. What a fucking adventure. Handmade radio. What the hell do we do with this? Gee, Pop, where'd you get all this treasure? It is a cursed fire horse, stolen from the ruins of an a... Is it a cursed... Uh, no, son, nothing like that. A sound investment in perfect normal and financial markets. Those voices are so... eerie. Holding it. Okay, there is one more. There's actually two downstairs. There's one here. Okay, there was one more. Ah, it was outside. Oh, there must be somewhere else. Let's check the Leather Brothers. Oh, a crash site. Lovely. Oi, no gators. Get back. Get out of here, gator. Not boss. Shut up. In a business meeting. Fine. Wait, I'm, am I alone? Thing to see here. Paul can't speak. Can't or won't. Don't. 
How did you become Mutefall? Uh, that's a very personal question. I need to make observation on the nature of questions, basically. Paul lost his tongue in a poker game. That's awful. Can we trade? Oh, a crowbar. Then swamp gas. Cater punch. Cater skin skin pants. And a little tag. Pickaxe. Could be good. Hi. Phlegmatic nod. Doesn't mean full of phlegm, it means calm and control. So say that then. Knowledge is in a calm and control nod. <laughs> this game is so hilarious. Does not contain Jenny in later. The ambiguity is clear now, and the person responsible for the original description has been sacked. Ugh. Say about the dead gator, sir, I didn't know he was a mailman. We would never intentionally hunt a mailman. Who are you? To my story, I'm a hunter, name of John Letters. Can tell from the accent, I'm from Albion. Although I hunted small game like mosquitoes and gnats and moved to foxes and wolves. I grew up. I like the game over here. Am I on the greatest hunt of all? What's that? Big picture. I like to build a ladder to heaven so I can hunt dinosaurs. It's more of a 5 to 10 year plan though. Uh, that's how either ladders or heaven works. I guess it's good to have a dream. Wouldn't be more practical to build a time machine? No, that just sounds ridiculous. Um, accusing you of killing a mailman. Already admitted to. Double jeopardy. Was it my way? I understand. Had no idea he was a mailman. If touched a mailman, if I'd known. Had nothing to do with it. Understand, I sir. What's wrong with killing a mailman? Hunter, alright. Most any spices is fair game for hunting, but mailman? Protected by international treaty. Last hunter I know who hunted mailman got pulled up by international criminal court and mailed to Mars. Is he okay? Obviously, ain't okay. Don't joke with me. That's a nightmare scenario for a hunter. Getting mailed to Mars? Sends shiver but down my spine, it does. Fo four. Never been asked so many questions before. You can talk the talk, alright, but what about hunting the hunt? Got work that needs to be doing. Saw to kill the mailman. They find me, I'm dead. You don't have to be a letterman to know which wind blows. They're asking me exactly. Something a really important project. For that, I need five gator hides. What's this project? I got not so fast. I need to know I can trust you. I won't go in there if I were you. Why? I don't like what to see. A busted egg. Told you it weren't a pretty sign. I was going to forward to eating that egg all day, and come dinner time, only went and bloody dropped it. Is that a gator egg? No, I think it's from a dog. Sorry for your loss, I bet. Okay, I do um I do need my 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 body back. Alright. We'll go with um, with him, because I haven't even seen his attacks yet. Okay, let's see what's in here. We will have to figure out the puzzle at Mud Range at some point. Round, given the condition of the arm, it seems like the body isn't attached to... to must have been down here for quite a time. A bizarre ring up with water, decided to just use the sound press the arm down below the surface count in the day. It's a day. Oh dear. Immune to poison. State your business. You're about the missing children? 
Yeah, that's a sad song. You'll need to talk to, uh, I guess, either Mr. Chapman or Miss Trace about that. Wouldn't let either of them know that you've been speaking to the other. The bosses, they don't talk anymore. What goes on at this place? Largemouth bass and sons? We fish largemouth bass and most of us are sons. I don't know. Don't the bosses speak to one another? Do you hear me? 3600 large mount bass. Mr. Chapman and Tracy haven't been speaking turns since Miss Chapman was snubbed at the Quademy Awards a few years back. They tolerate each other only because they both perform a functions and the business, which is debones the fish and Miss Chapman rebones them. Only then the fish are ready to sell the market. Saying you take out the fish's bone and then put them back in. It's tradition. For generation, a Chapman debon deboned the bass and a Tracy rebones them. That unique process what gives our bass its distinctive tang. What do you think happened to the kids? If you ask me, that's what I just did. Hell, they ran off. This life isn't for everyone. They never had the makings of a large mouth bass deboner or reboner. Mm. Declaration of dependence. To die but his body was never found. You're not planning on sticking that rod in here. Large mouth bass and son have exclusive license to fish this water. Is there any way I can fish here? Fishing might makes fishing right. This is a small mouth bass and nephew, but nephews, but here we run things differently. Oh now it's raining. That's a gloomy face. Talk to the puddle or the man. The puddle, please. Hello, sir. I can't understand you. It's a puddle. <laughs> okay, talk to the man. She's left me. Who left you? Amphibious struck. Oh, it's another person. No, I'm more interested in amphibious trucks. So, what happened to your truck? Our truck. It's the company truck. He used to take. The fish to market a couple of nights ago. I forgot to fill her up before bed. That must have really ticked her off because the next morning she was gone. No, no, nothing. Are you suggesting this truck is sentient? It's funny, I wouldn't have thought so, but I can't see any other explanation for it running off the way it has. Do you have anything to do with the missing kids? Tommy Caddy? I have to speak to Mr. Chapman or Mr. Tracy about that. What's this puddle here? It's the gas I never gave her that night. It's here now in our special place, waiting for her. Waiting for her to come home. Is it working? Obviously you can see it is not. How far could someone have gone in a truck? With that gas left in her, couldn't have gone further than a hundred miles. hundred miles, okay. No, a hundred, sorry. Hundred is a fisherman lingo, it means eleven. Missing truck, that's a shame. She'll be back. She has to come back. Out of gas, otherwise, and where she'll be then? I don't know, the mile's not that far. Hmm. Right there's a mess. That's okay, I don't mind. Not messy, it's the mess. As in, where we have our meals. Thought they only called it a mess in the armed forces. And is fishing not the armed forces? What do we use to hold the rods, huh? Your... I don't know, your legs? Don't waste my time. Cat! Only true loyal fishmen. Chum. Those are decorative, and the chum inside is the very first batch of chum ever made by large mouth bass and sons back in the summer 84 AO3. Reminds me of our horrible beginnings. Can I have it? No. Only for fishermen. What is it? Fish. Can I fish there? Ha. Huh. Those are crew quarters. Wait, you live here? Where we fish? Where fish live? We live. Can I go inside? Or the, our family's private quarters? I gooner let the dog fish loose in my socks. Is that something you do? Rarely. It is hilarious. 
Mishu had had a glorious death at sea. Oh, oh, many a sea creature has tried to give me one, pal, but before they can get their teeth in me, I've reboned them six ways to Sontang. Spits a wad of chewing tobacco out the door. Guy Chapman, Chief Reboning Officer, Largemouth Bath and Sons. Uh, are you here about Tom? It's not a poster about the missing children. Find the other. My Tom has been lured into the lair of Oakham Gator by the Jezebel of a deboner's daughter. Good and true fisherman led astray by the Lincoln sorceress who's never cared a Walt Whitman for what we do here. Oh my god. Yeah, a little sexist, don't you think? Not remotely. Not saying anything about her gender at all. Only saying that she might have gotten my boy eaten by a government. You use throw words like Gisebo around, that's a little loaded. Is it? It didn't mean anything I I'm willing to change, but you have to be patient with me, alright? I'm old fashioned and I can't keep up with all these new ideas your generation has. Gender penicillin? Occam's gator? Oh my god, Occam's razor. I'm sure that there is no creature of land nor sea quite so terrible. 12 feet tall. Red as a furnace. But I'm wondering what we did to deserve him. It is a sin against the land of the bonery bone fish. Perhaps, perhaps. But damn it, what's. That's what gives our best singing. How oh, is Cathy responsible? Arrogance of youth! Don't you think Tom could have run away on his own? Third generation bass boy, proud and true. Last one said, I'm excited about my fisher and reboning large mouth, mouth bass, dad. The words of a boy with one foot out the door. Siren song of Cathy. Is there a finder's fee? 200 meat for starters. And my fish mother's fishing rod for the entree on one condition. I don't want you looking for Cathy on Tracy's dime. It's Tom that needs saving, and he needs saving from her. So that's a condition. So we need to find Tom. That's two conditions. Is there a fish special fishing rod? Has never caught a fish. Sounds worse than a normal fishing rod. Or caught a fish. He always catches two. Don't know how it works. Don't want to know how it works. We just thank Poseidon for the bounty. Let me think about it. Also looking for Charles. The name, some fool wrote it on the missing poster I had up for Tommy. Wondering who or what he is. Is he a fish? No. Not the person to ask. I'm a fisherman, friend. My bag is fish. You're looking for a human? You want to be asking sort of human fisherman. Haha. Uh -huh. You are a human fisherman. I know where your friend is, alright. What do you do here? Chief reboning officer. Okay. I don't think we are anywhere close to six mocks. Ah, we could get there. And gain fishing rights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we also have loads of skills. Mm, our maximum AP from here. I would like to get that. I guess we'll save them for now. Throwing in the fishing rights. So, Garland, in the end, I'll tear you out. Largemouth bass. I'll give you 10 minutes alone with the fish. How about that? No questions asked. Deal. It's a diary. Hmm. I'll bring you home, you hear me? I'll try. It's locked. Oh, we have a crowbar. Nice. Tom's hole. 
He found, please return to largemouth bass and sons for controversial thoughts and secret plans. Turn to page 19. No consequence to the to purge 33. Only way we won't be followed is if we take the truck through the gate room and camp. We'll ask Peter where it is. Aha! They took the truck. Three toad squid, chihuahua. What the fuck? Egg cat. Wait, is this... Ha ha! Oh god. Bone broth. And heart tech. Alright. And I guess on the other side is... The other person. Yep. Us back here, a quarter. How did you know that? As is, maybe the two of you are more similar than you like to think. Wash your mouth with fish soap. I don't think I will. I can find the misfortune of a stolen daughter. Any idea who did this? Who did this? Chance your daughter could have opened the safe. Told her that combination was free. Thomas Gator did not have his clothes in his. When did this happen? Three nights ago. I'm still in shock. I must have the strength to close the safe. I can do that for you. It's not hard. Would you? Sure. Bless you. This is the mess? It is. And just so you know, the fish we serve here is deboned. And that's just the way we like it. I don't want to see you putting your new bones in fish. You definitely won't see that. And they have a cat too. Original sandwich. Wait, what? Ah, fuck. Yuck. Do we have to eat something else? Ah, perfect. Mm. Take all the reverse of the sign which reads, if you can. Yeah, we can. I'll take the annoying sign as well. Just sell it if you can. Ah. I ate your sandwich. It's a decoy. Nobody's ever found the real thing. Fuck. Well, he he got us. What do you do here? Chief deboning officer. She might have run away from home. That's impossible. Hmm. Out comes Gator. Yeah. How comes Gator sounds made up? Blue Gator man who eats guns? One of our guards actually saw how comes, even took a shot at him, but conventional weapons have no effect. Saying you ha you haven't seen how comes Gator? I've seen the destruction he's wrought, I've certainly seen that. Friend Charles is missing. Nasty piece of vandalism. <laughs> Aren't we too late? Hmm. Terminate him for attempting to unionize. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, well, we'll do the other guy, it seems. Have to find him somewhere. Probably at the Gator Man's village. But we'll do that in the next episode. It's been long enough already. So, uh, yeah, hope you all enjoyed watching. Make sure you have a like, subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time with a ring to make. It has stopped working. Bye-bye.